everybody. Welcome to another brand new episode of Tech That Does It Bite. Yeah. yeah. Ooh, I'm ooh. Simon C. And joining me, of course, is... Jeff Worden. It's great to see everybody for another episode of Tech That Absolutely. Does It Bite. Today, today, we actually have a tech tip that Simon tech is going to tip, demonstrate for us. And today we... What is, the, what is that tip going well, to be, Simon? good question. Today's tech tip is how to fix Audacity in Mac OS Catalina. Hmm. That's an oddly specific yeah. fix, though, but I would imagine a lot of Audacity users. I'm not one of them myself, but I know that it's a very good sound Absolutely. recording program. Absolutely, and the so. main problem is that right now, uh, the latest version, ever since Catalina came out, um, when you plug in your USB microphone, it doesn't detect it properly so oh, that's a that's a that's, that's a, a problem. big problem that's a yeah, big, that's a big problem. problem ladies and <laughs> gentlemen so the problem is let's go here so this is my computer so first thing really the background of it is why doesn't it work is that uh beginning with catalina a lot of the apps that are not distributed on the mac store they need to be uh notarized um so what what exactly is notarization? You no, know, it's a good question. I believe is to let Apple detect, you know, do a better job of detecting uh, malicious software. So okay, so it sounds like it's just saying, okay, this is now okay and clear to use it's on more software. Of a, it's that, more of a like security a thing. So you know, right. when it comes to security stuff, the more secure, there's always inconvenience with it. You know, so right. so in order right. to fix that, um, Audacity has not done the notarization yet uh, according to their website so so what you can do is go to audacity's website so before that let me show mm. everyone what the problem is so okay let me launch audacity okay so we're gonna launch audacity do, 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 do. and this is the latest version 2.3.3 all right so mm. I have my Blue Yeti plugged in, as you can see. Okay. Right on. All plugged in. USB, USB plugged, plugged in. in. Let me hit record. Hello? Hello? Huh? What's going on? Oh, I don't What's see anything on? there, Simon. Oh, no. It's the end. There's oh, nothing no. there. What do I do? Oh, my God. What do I do? Oh, no. It's, horrible. it's so horrible. I know, right? So. Don't, don't panic. panic. There's a way to fix this. So close out Audacity right. first. Open up a terminal window. Okay, mm. the good old terminal, Jeff. You remember? Yeah. Okay, I remember it well. So I remember it go well. to Audacity's website. All you need to do is go to the forum. I have the link in the description below, and then you will All see right. a quick fix, a workaround for it. So basically, make sure you mm. close out Audacity first. Okay, launch the terminal app which we just did. Right, now right. you see right here, the terminal command, rather than just typing it, I don't know if anyone can see it, let me scroll down a little bit, rather than just typing it, go. Ah, now I see it. why don't you just copy and paste it? So once you copy and paste it, bam, Audacity will load again. Okay. There you go. So I'm gonna minimize the uh, terminal window and the browser. So again, we're rerunning Audacity again, but this time using the terminal command. So now you right, see my so Blue Yeti microphone. Yeah, so here I am. Mm -hmm. Now click on record. Testing. This is a recording of the testing that I'm doing. Mm. Testing, testing, one, two. Neat. Testing, testing, one, two. I, I see sound, sound waves. waves. Cool. Ladies and gentlemen. Now I want to make sure that it actually works. I'm going to do a little playback. Ladies and gentlemen, let's see if it works. Testing, testing, one, two. Testing, testing, one, two. I hear it. Absolutely. So that's how you fix the Audacity problem in macOS Catalina. Very cool. That's a neat it's fix. A neat I like fix. that. Uh, the one downside to this is that you're going to have to run that terminal command every single time. So definitely go check out that forum link and uh, copy and paste that to like a text edit document or find a way to keep it safe you know store it in your computer because right, right. until audacity fixes this this issue you're gonna have to keep launching it using the terminal command 
Now, I'm not, I'm not as max savvy as I would like to be. Can you make a command or a shortcut or a batch file believe, that would run it automatically from I believe you could run a script, uh, but that's for okay. your script geniuses out there because I don't know how to do that. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm sure it's not that hard. We'll fi- you know what? We'll have something next time around. We'll figure yeah, it out. Yeah, we will. And Definitely figure Jeff that out. just got a phone call. I mean, that's the signal. Well, no, no. It yeah. went away. That's the signal. That's a warning <laughs> signal to tell us to end the show now. <laughs> Absolutely. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for coming to another episode of Tech That Doesn't Bite. That was our tech tip of the day to help out with uh, Audacity on Catalina. If you have anything you'd like to have uh, broadcast as a tech tip, definitely comment below and like like and subscribe Absolutely. to our channel. And if you do know how to write it in script, you know, the little fix that we just did, let us know. Post a link in that the bottom. Help. Let us know how to do it. So Absolutely. Our viewers as well. Yeah. yeah. But until next time. Thank you for joining us today. You have a good one.